The Waconia Independent School District received two Farmer School grants to help make additions to Clearwater Middle School. The 2014 grant assisted in renovations made on the Quonset Hut, while the 2015 grant made it possible for the district to add a pasta maker, frozen yogurt machine, and popcorn machine. You know, the Farm to School grant came on the horizon and we decided it would be a really am amazing opportunity for our district to head in the direction of our mission, which is to, to steer toward more scratch cooking and more whole foods. We have a grand director who, uh, who sat with me and he said, you know, if, if there is no limit, you know, what would you imagine or what would you think of? And, and with that sort of in mind, I was able to kind of construct a plan of, of what we could potentially do with our garden, what we could potentially do with local farmers, which we've already had some um, communications with and already had some relationships with, but this allowed us to expand that option almost limitless as to what we can choose and what we can source. So this grant allowed us to be part of uh, a community-wide effort to promote Minnesota growing. Our grocery store, our local hospital and healthcare programs are also on board with us as part of a, an initiative with a wellness group in the community to to enrich the lives of our community by, by exposing them to more natural foods and more healthful foods. We had a, an event where we peeled our own care, or we peeled our own potatoes or mashed potatoes for 4,000 students in our district. It was kind of priceless in the fact that kids just thought that they were like magically put on their plate. And really, truly, there's a farmer who puts the seed in the ground, there's somebody who tends it, there's somebody who harvests it. And that's a part of the effort. And then it comes cleaned into a box, and then there's a the whole knocking it down process kids really had no sense of what that takes. You know, without the Farm to School grant, I don't think our district would have moved this direction. Us receiving the Farm to School grant has allowed us to have a, a strong voice in the community because we're leaders as being part of the educational uh, platform where we're staging changes that are expected or encouraged in our community. 